Sometimes as a writer, you just have to take a leap of faith. I'm going to tell you a little bit about the story about how I got a book deal. I'm Mark J. Gregson. My book, Sky's End, is getting published in spring 2024 by Peachtree Teen. So a couple years ago, I signed with my literary agent. It took me a long time to get a literary agent. After I signed with her, I got some notes from her that were really difficult. Editorial notes that she told me that they needed to do to fix the book. Because the book had some issues and she wanted to move it from good to great. And the notes were so extensive that I decided to work on another project in the meantime. Finally, when I was recovering from some light surgery, I started having some dreams. I had some bizarre dreams. And I started thinking about my book um, and all the edits that she had given me. Out of all of my projects, this book was the most near and dear to me. But my agent had been real with me. She told me that it was going to be a tough sell. Not only had I written a young adult fantasy and the market was saturated with those, a lot of publishers already had their quota filled, but I also wrote a book with a boy pro tag. Um, not that there's a problem with a boy pro tag in young adult, but generally there's more girl pro tags in young adult uh, fiction. I just really had to take a leap of faith. And so I sat down and I started revising. And it took me a long time. It took me five months. I had to rewrite the beginning of the book. I had to rewrite the ending of the book. So 180 pages completely rewritten. But not only that, I went through the whole book and I changed it from past tense to present tense. So every single line in the book had to actually be adjusted so that it would match the new tense. I killed uh, a character, um, I moved chapters around, like the whole book was completely different. And I also put everything I had into it, every emotion that I had in my body was put into the book. And I knew that this was a huge risk because emotionally it was going to really hurt if this book did not get published. But by the time I finished it, when I sent it off to my agent, I remember sitting in my car with my wife and telling her, like, this book has a real chance and it's going to be devastating if it doesn't happen but it has a real chance when the book went on submission finally um, after I did all the revisions and we went on submission with it we sent it out to publishers and in that first list of like six editors that we sent it out to the second one offered on the book and it was just so surreal and so exciting sometimes you just have to take a leap of faith in writing and sometimes you're going to expose yourself and it's going to be hard and sometimes it's really going to hurt but it can pay off too